Ladies and gentle folks, welcome to a brand new Fallout series I'm calling Fuck Around and Find Out. In these videos what we will do is we will take a random weapon of choice, or one that is suggested by you, and we'll fuck about with it and find out if it's any good. Now today's weapon of choice is not a choice because I picked it, and it's a Crusader pistol. I want to see if it's any good. And we shall see if it's any good. With... Not the raiders. We won't, we won't kill the raiders. I'll go find something to kill. Now, you find me here at Fort Defiance. Why? Because it has things that shoot back at you, things that don't shoot back at you, and things that either bite you, sting you, or give you diseases. And we're all about testing, and I have no perks to benefit this weapon. As you can see, I don't have the perks on, the pistol perks, the, uh, 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 yeah. Them ones. Are they? Yeah, the gunslinger perks. I don't have none of them equipped, so we're just going to see what it does. See if it's any good. This is just a basic 10mm, and because it comes in a variety of flavours, we will be testing each one. That one sucks, though. Alright, let's try this one. That's a little bit better. Thank you. Still takes a fuckload of bullets to put them down though. Alright, what's next? The cryo. Oh, you're, you're nearly dead already, that's not fair. You. Oh, this one's ass as well. It's not bad if you use vats. What's next? Fusion. Now the rules are, I cannot make them legendary to make them extra powerful. I have to taste them base. Basic. As they come. The normal. Well, there doesn't seem to be any more. Oh, there is. There's one. Oh. 17 base, 33 with a head, plus to take tick damage. Alright, the pyro might be the way to go. Hmm. Or incendiary rounds, if you actually know what you're talking about. And if you're using it in a shotgun, dragon's breath. Let's put the gunslinger perks on. See what they do. Uh, I'll bring you back. All right, now we've got us gunslinger perks on. We're at the airport, and we're testing them against the scorched again. Ah, oh, that's significantly more damage. Ah, oh, most definitely. Bear in mind, I'm using a ten millimeter, just a basic ten millimeter, and that's a lot more damage than it was. Okay, five, five, six. See how you do. Bear in mind there are no legendaries. This is just a base weapon. All I've done is change the ammo type out. And that's it. Okay, come on, where the hell are you? The reason I'm using Scorched is because, more than likely, these are the first enemies people are going to be coming across. Hmm. Alright, so 556 does 31. 10 mil does 20, whatever the fuck it was. 27. Okay, so 556 pretty good. Try the cryo. That's 70 with a headshot. 35. It's a little bit more damage. Uh huh. What about the fusion? 35, 70 with a headshot, what about the fire, 35, Damn. ooh, 192 with a crit,
70, 35. All right, the f the fire damage seems to be doing a lot more. Let's see what the tick is on the fire damage. Oh yeah, that is a lot more. All right. Conclusion: If you're gonna use this weapon, put the pyro pyro mod on it. It still only takes ten millimeter. Okay, let's go find something a little bit harder to shoot at. Okay, we're here, and you might be thinking, I know this cave. This cave is very recognisable to me. It will be. This is where the death claw lives. Usually a low one, level hundred. And now you're thinking, well, now you've just gone from one extreme to the other. There's a reason why this series is called Fuck Around and Find Out. We need to know if it will kill a Deathclaw. We need to know if it will kill something which has a lot of health. And a Deathclaw has a lot of health. Still alive. Yeah, you're alive. Okay. 13. Uh. Okay. The 10 millimeter is ass. What about the 5.56? Five, five, not much better. Ah, damn. And he got me killed. But that's why we experiment. I do the dangerous bits so you don't have to. No says you can go back. He went back. He didn't listen to me. No. Fifteen twenty-nine. Oh, seventeen. The cryo one is ass. Uh, run, run, run. All right. So cryo is it. Fusion's not much better. Where are you running off to come back? Yeah, fusion one sucks as well. <coughs> Run away. Alright, try the pile one. The insane one. Ugh. All right. How much is your health going down? Not by a lot. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't think this would go well. Where the fuck have we gone now? Okay, let's aim for its soft spot. Okay, that's 29. No. Oh, that's a hell of a lot more. Oh, I'm stuck. Ugh. That's 91. Fusion. 34. Right up. 34, 556, reload, 29, Jesus, 10, what, no, no, I can't be, 26, so, hang on, hang on, if you're going to kill a death claw, aim for the belly, and use a pirate fire one, so, I don't even have bloody mess on. So, conclusion. If you're going to use a weapon, well, if you're going to use a pi the Crusader, put the Pyro mod on it. It's worth it. The other one's are ass. 25 to take damage over 5 seconds. Hmm. One last experiment before we go. Okay, you find me here at Westex, which super mutants are the norm. Usually. Who the fuck are they? Is everybody dead? We all get killed. We all stupid. Ah, oh, someone's leveling up, never mind. Oh, time for experiment number three. So. We did the scorched. It's not bad. The fire one, one with that one. It's the death claw. It's not bad. The fire one, one with that one too. 
Oh, hello. Now we're going to do a super mutants. I'm not going to be quiet about it. We need to know. Nineteen. Twenty-two. <sighs> Twenty-two. Twenty-four. Damn. Twenty-seven. Fifty-three with a headshot. I didn't check the headshots. Okay, let's try that one again. All right. 19. Basic damage. 38 with a headshot. God, I'm going to run out of steam packs. Okay, what you got? 22 basic damage. I missed. 43 with a headshot. Twenty-four. Forty-eight with a headshot. Fucking hell. Twenty-seven. Dead. Fifty-two with a headshot. Might have a winner with that one. Uh-oh. Forty-six. What? Forty-eight with a headshot. Alright, let me check that again. 24, 24, I must have hit a weak spot. 48 with a headshot. Um. Alright, see what the tick damage is. No. Uh, 48. Oh, hang on. Do you mind if I regen my stamina, please? I've got action boy on, haven't I? Yeah, I do. Alright. It'd help if I could hit. Not on that. 53. 53 with a headshot. Not bad. 48. Oh, that's just aw that's awful. 43. Press it again. 43. What? Oh, 72? No. Nah. How many coffee or something? Jesus. Thirty-eight. Right, that makes more sense. Forty-three. I'm not over encumbered. I don't think I'm addicted to anything. Get rid of that one. Why the hell am I not? Because I have a disease. Probably because I've got a disease. I've usually got a disease. I'm used to it, alright. 48. Ah, oh, this uses a lot of shit. Aim straight, you pillock. My AP is not going up at all. for a little bit. Damn. Alright, 56. 
that's good damage. So the insane ones are the way to go. Obviously. 140 over crit, that's actually not bad. But this one is with a crit. What was that? Okay. Uh, I didn't see it. I'm not over encumbered, am I? No. Oh. 150. Hang on. Might help with a reload. Wow. Most of this video is just me waiting for my AP to regen. I should have taken a disease cure. 137. Wow, that's that that's awful. My AP going down every time I get shot is not good. Hundred and twenty five, yep, that's expected. And it takes a couple of clip clips to get rid of him. A couple of magazines to get rid of a dog. That's not good. Alright. Hundred and eighteen. So yeah. You ain't send ones away to go. If you are using a pistol build. And I bet if it were legendary it might be a little bit better. But bear in mind. All this is just straight up basic stuffs. There's nothing extra. There's nothing special. Nothing like that. I hope you found it informative. Don't forget to come back for, <laughs> for the next one. Which, if you have a weapon, you wish for me to test. As in, a basic test. No. No. Legendaries. That's the only rule, I'm afraid. Not allowed any legendaries. Just a basic, bog standard weapon. You let me know. I give it a whirl. I'll test it out. And you'll be able to see the results. I hope you found this one informative. Thank you all for watching. And don't forget to come back for the next one. Bye.